11 Best Second Lead Couples Second Lead Syndrome often strikes in the form of a handsome second leading opa who gives some fierce competition to our male lead. But you might have also noticed there might be a second leading couple who gives the leads a run for their money. They've got us rooting for them almost more than the leads themselves. We owe thanks to the writers for occasionally adding this compelling dynamic to their stories. As viewers, we get treated to not one, but two love stories. While this concept might be more evident in rom-coms or romantic melodramas, here's our short but sweet list of those second leading OTPs. Reaction time. These couples are all just darling. However, the couples in spots number one and number three left us with so many feels. Number 11, Reply 1988. The famous Reply series is known for its slice of life and coming-of-age depictions of youth, but also for its romances. In Reply 1988, viewers were shipping the love of this couple, who seemed to fall into a relationship on the sly, just kind of quiet between them. And that was the love between Sung Sung Woo and Sung Bora. But it seemed that Sung Woo had a really big crush on his friend's older sister, Bora. But in turn, she also had a crush towards Sung Woo. These two might have kept things quiet on the surface, but their warmth for each other did not go unnoticed by viewers. Number 10. What's Wrong with Secretary Kim? Bong Se-ra and Young Chul shared several comedic moments to build up to their romance, and their chemistry was most certainly fire. Sarah always wanted to put out her best self-image, and she was completely attracted to good-looking guys. However, in one moment, that could have been the ultimate embarrassment for her. The handsome Young Chul kind of saved the day and her self-image. Who wouldn't fall for this kind of gesture? Well, she certainly did. Sparks and more sparks could even be felt by viewers as we watch the side couple fall in love with even the build-up to a confession. They are just too cute. Number 9. Search WWW The intense and competitive situation drama features strong, hardworking women in a dynamic industry of a web portal company. With this setting the stage, a Nuna romance might have been unexpected for our second lead characters, but it happened and we love it. It should be mentioned that this K-drama has multiple mains. Cha Hyun crosses paths and falls for Sol Ji Hwan. Sparks fly, and the essence of a romance to bloom is evident between them. Their chemistry and connection is just so strong. Number 8. High Society it could be noted in High Society, the second leading couple definitely gave the leading couple a fierce challenge for the most adored by viewers. It's a sweet and often welcome touch to a drama to not just have one romance dominating the story, but two, showcasing the second leads, their problems and their love lives. The second pairing in High Society gave viewers a charming poor girl and a rich CEO. While our poor girl is practical in her views of the world, our handsome and rich CEO falls desperately in love with her and wants her to be part of his life. Prepare for the double feels in this K-drama. Number 7. Run On Aside from any love blossoming between the main leading characters in Run On, another couple's love was highlighted here, where a sports CEO meets an art student. The drama showcases their personality differences, but there's definitely something there, a strong connection, which pulls them towards each other. With artworks as a focal point in their romance, these two fall for each other and have a beautiful love story. Run On is a romantic drama with slice-of-life vibes. The main couple's story follows a former national team sprinter and our female lead whose job is translating movie subtitles. Both couples enchanted viewers. Number 6. Descendants of the Sun If you're looking for romance and action, DOTS could be your cup of tea. This K-drama is famous internationally, with the two main leads soaring to fame and superstardom, better known as the Song Song Couple. But in this mention, we're going to discuss the supporting leads who melted our hearts, Dae Young and Myung Ju. While the duties of being soldiers might have had the odds stacked against them being able to love openly, we knew there was something there all along. There was some avoidance and skirting around what they felt. From their line of obligations to family, their love might have not been the easiest, but it's one you don't want to miss. Number 5. Crash Landing on You The famous K-drama delighted fans worldwide with its story of a rich heiress and a North Korean army captain. 
Their love was an incredible story, but today we are focusing on the prominent and standout second lead couple, Song Jun and Sa Dan. Our second male lead is a con artist in hiding, taking up lodging in North Korea. Here he meets a beautiful, opinionated, and self-directed young woman. They seem like complete opposites, with North meeting South. Their love has some challenges as well, but the development of their relationship and thoughtfulness for each other is beautifully depicted. They might not be easy characters, as in their personalities and backstories, maybe even at times a little unlikable towards our main leads, but they'll soon grow on you and surprise you. Number 4. The Master's Son Sometimes, another romance in a drama might not have been heavily featured, but maybe more of a subtle side couple thing. The Master's Son is one of the greatest Korean romantic dramas you'll ever see, mixing in spooky ghosts and a strong main romance between our leads. While our female lead might have early on felt a connection to our second male lead, played by So Eun-guk, he later interacts with our other female character. While she might seem a little stuck up or bossy, they do certainly complement each other, and we found their budding romance cute and amusing. Number 3. A Business Proposal Our leads are all connected here due to a blind date circumstance. There's no doubt that the main OTP is going to cheer you up and you'll be smitten by their story. But what might be even better is how good the second leads are. They certainly almost stole the show with their chemistry, which is so incredibly fierce. We rooted for them the whole time. What a coincidence when our second female lead moves in next door to our second male lead. And it's then pretty solidified. They are going to end up together. You can't fight fate. Number 2. Goblin You might be so familiar with this drama. Maybe we could even call it a beloved classic now. The lead couple will capture your heart, the goblin and his goblin bride. But as for our second leads, the cheerful and independent Sunny, and a handsome Grim Reaper who's so drawn to her. He and the cute beauty share a past, a reincarnated past that is. Fate brings them back together. Will their second chance allow for amends to be made? The story of Goblin stems from how our choices affect our future. The Reaper and Sunny moments are some of the cutest, but still there's that past connection that might dampen the mood until this pairing can resolve and find their way back to love. But the great thing about a reincarnated love is that it keeps reoccurring over and over and over again. We just love these two. Number 1. Fight For My Way Fight For My Way was such a moving drama in the way it captured the struggles of young adults who pursued their dreams. Life is not always easy, even sometimes, trying one's best doesn't always field the result you want. But not giving up is a message we see in this drama, and within their friend circle is our second OTP, a couple who seems to have been together forever, and whose relationship is kept under wraps at their workplace. Juman and Solhi might have even moved us to tears during the challenges of their relationship. They give their love everything they've got, and this representation of love in the face of conflict feels very real. Bonus mentions other K-dramas with a subtle or strong romance between another couple is featured. The Bride of Payback, Hospital Playlist, Dream High, pretty much all of the Reply series, and The Beauty Inside. Do you have a favorite second leading OTP? And did we miss any? If so, you can let us know in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching, MDLers. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next video.